Hey everybody, welcome back to Bob Key TV and another thriller, stage number 11 of this year's Volta, going the direction of Chris Froome in a pretty furious final climb to the finish. Locked in battle with Nairo Quintana. Esteban Chavez looked like he had done enough to win the stage with about two kilometers to go, timing a brilliant maneuver to perfection. But Quintana attacking out of the field in the last K and a half, closing the gap down to Esteban Chavez, uh, but could not get rid of Chris Froome in the finale. And Froome sprinting past Quintana for the stage win and a very perhaps important time bonus of uh, 10 seconds. Quintana gets six. So Chris Froome pulls himself four seconds closer to Quintana and maybe the most impressive ride yet for Chris Froome in this year's Volta. Uh, and Quintana said yesterday on the rest day, he would prefer to have three minutes advantage before the stage 19 uh, time trial, individual time trial, almost 40 kilometers long. Uh, definitely favors Froome dog. So Froomey uh, in control of the Vuelta right now. Pretty amazing. Still plenty of mountains to go, but the good news, it's going to be a very exciting Vuelta a España all the way to the finish. Uh, the bad news, I can't think of any <laughs> right now, unless perhaps you're on the Tinkoff squad, and in spite of a massive turn of speed and tempo on the front of the peloton, Alberto Contador lost some more ground on today's stage and is now over three minutes behind Nairo Quintana. Uh, like I said, plenty of climbing stages to go, but I thought that Contador would come out swinging and really not only win the stage, but get some time back on Froome, Quintana, Valverde, Chavez, the four riders that are ahead of him. Um, brilliant riding by the, by the Tinkoff squad, but Alberto could not quite finish it off. Um, uh, that would be pretty discouraging. Alberto is a fighter. I'm sure he'll come out swinging. When he has the legs, he will attack. There's no doubt about that. Uh, but for Chris Froome, a solid day in the Tour of Spain. I'll bet they'll be quite pleased uh, at the Sky Table tonight. Not just for a stage win, but for Froome keeping himself in contention to win. If he wins this Vuelta, it'll be the first time since 2008 that somebody has won two Grand Tours in the same season. That was Alberto Contador, but a full eight years ago at this point. Wow! Time flies when you're having fun watching bike racing. Hope it's been fun for everybody. Please keep the subscriptions coming. I need those to stay on the air. That is the bottom line. That is a fact. That you can take to the bank. Um, thumbs up if you like these. Comments, keep them coming. Who's gonna win? Is Froome Dog gonna prevail? Is Contador out of contention entirely? Is Chavez gonna make a miraculous attack in the mountains to come and surprise everybody? Uh, let me know what your thoughts are. Follow me on Twitter and Facebook. And thanks everybody so much for watching.